Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to Grid Life Laguna at WeatherTech Raceway Laguna Seca, a westward mission that Grid Life has had for all these years to bring the festival experience westward. Welcome back. I'm Kyle Heyer alongside Greg Kramer. This morning, we've got... All right, so day two, I apologize for the footage from day one. Uh, we had some guys fill in, so the lenses got a little dirty. Uh, just because they weren't familiar with the gear, but uh, hopefully today is better. But we're here, day two, second day of competition, and both advanced from yesterday's rounds. Um, yeah, I, I don't think and for me it doesn't matter. Yeah, it doesn't matter because there was only four competitors for him. But uh, what's your goals? Overall, try to finish top three overall. Top three overall. Right now, I think I'm fifth or sixth right now. So okay. definitely got a lot of time to shave today. Yeah. And uh, conditions are looking good, so. Should yeah, be able to set really the, good. Should be able to set the lap today. Gabe's yeah. on stickers today. I'm on pretty fresh tire stickers from last session. So uh, nice and broken in. Yeah, I think everyone thought that tomorrow was also going to be delayed because it was supposed to be fog all day. And when we woke up and went outside, I didn't even notice it until we were driving here that there was no clouds anywhere. So um, yeah, it should be a good time. I'm hoping to get in the sub 30s. We'll see how low. Um, yeah, I'm ready. Sub 30s and low 20s for me. Yeah, and let's get the fuck out of here. Yeah.
Heidi Zamora in the 274 picked up as well to a 130.9. So this has been a very good session for picking up times this morning. We've seen basically the top five in every category shift or shuffle at some point. We've uh, kind of, while you know, we're doing that, we might as well show you the top five here in the track mod category. Here's a look at your session results. Andrew DeKonig still the top seed in that group. George Zhao, Gabe Zamora, Robert Robles, and Team Formula S all in the advancing group. It's about one point. When we start rolling, no, too, so I everyone, did this. you said this. No, I saw that. Okay. So that's exactly what I saw, and that's why I started sending him. Nope. Okay. Well, I'm just letting you know what it looked like when you go okay. like that. It looked the same. Okay. I need you to fucking roll. I'm gonna roll you back. They just gave a false alarm. He's being a fucking dick. So I'm gonna push you straight back. We're still on a hold. Wheel straight. Thank you again, Pete. Absolutely. Thank you guys for being here. Oh, you're good, man. Thank you. Good time to be mic'd up. <laughs> so they're saying oil was on track, they're doing a cleanup. It sounds like cars are out there, I'm not sure how true that is. Uh, we're going to wait for them to get the okay. The car is a sick one. It uh, participated in Asian Le Mans series when it was new, 2014 chassis. Um, traveled the world and then he got it about maybe one, two years ago. And we've been running it ever since. Uh, I like the library with the circuit board stuff and all of that. Did you guys get it that way? Uh, no, it came in a, a different paint scheme. It's actually white and red. It came from some guy in like Bangkok or something that had a sketchy business. So <laughs> that came off. This went on when he bought it. Um, it's close to. Because I drove that car out there last year, the Fit. And then I drove it out again this year. They've been at Willow Springs before. That's, I don't know. I thought this was your first time to the West Coast. You know, and then we did like a week, we did like a weekday thing at Willow, a couple like pre pandemic. Yeah, okay. So. That might be what it is.
he's only had one shot at it you know, <laughs> yeah. a session. So yeah. give him a couple laps, give him some more time, maybe a podium sprint run later today. He'll be right in the mix. Jason Chin, Silas Montgomery, Riley Stair, the rest of the front runners there in the Super Unlimited class. And then in yeah, guys, we uh, got done with the first session of the day. You know, pretty cool compared to yesterday. Less fog. Uh, car felt really good. Went on the... Uh, scrub stickers from yesterday and uh, set down to 24 which is about a second faster than uh, last session yesterday so overall happy with the car nope. yeah. Yeah. all right so wrapped up my session first hot lap I go off in the corkscrew insert the back up now Jason's shaking his head over here in the background. Uh, so basically I got the two right tires up on the green paint, which is super slick. There's no rubber there. It's like straight up green paint. Uh, kicked in ABS, but it didn't stop in time for the corkscrew entry and went all four off on my first hot lap. So had to come in. It was kind of like a uh, urgency to get in because I don't know how many laps I have. And I don't know how this system's actually working with like people advancing to the next round. I thought we advanced the next round yesterday and I thought we advanced today as well, but um, I, there's like three more sessions. I don't know. We'll figure it out. We'll just keep setting fast laps. But uh, went back out, set a 131.9. Session got black flagged. Miata crashed in front of me. I'll insert that. Hit the wall. Lost the bumper. Um, so they black flagged to get him off the track. And then went back out and set a 30.9. So faster, but not the goal. I haven't reached the goal yet. So we rotated the tires. Tracks, I think it's only getting warmer. So conditions are different than yesterday for sure maybe a little more difficult but still i think we can get a sub 30 in this condition Once again, looking ahead to the podium sprint, you know, assuming De Koenig and Zhao are going to be in it. I mean, look at that. There's three tenths between them. Uh, and uh, you just add another three tenths, and you include Zamora in that bunch. It's going to be superb. And very different car. Energy Track Battle Championship Podium Sprint here at WeatherTech Raceway, Laguna Seca. Lots of new names, yeah. four new names in this top five competing against Andrew DeKonig, who has won a couple of events with us this season. So uh, the grid life regular at the top of the order there, but four drivers that will hunt him down in the podium sprint are right behind. Still able to drive. It only, it only wouldn't turn back on when I came here. Came in. Yeah. Yeah, last session, uh, my car's dash just started turning on and off, rebooting, but the car was still able to drive somehow. Then. 
when we came back to the pits for pressures and uh, I was getting released, the car just wouldn't turn back on, so right now it's bad. So I had to get pushed back in the garage and uh, try and diagnose the problem right now. All right, so uh, just got the word. Well, first of all, our last session, which was the last quality session, my goal is to go out and just lay one hot lap. And if it was where I wanted it to be, then I was gonna come in and chill because fifth, fifth to like eighth place was all in the 33s and I'm in the 30s. So they would have to do some crazy shit to get in um, or to knock me off. Set a good lap, came in, watched timing and scoring and finished first overall in that uh, session. Track's getting slower uh, as it gets hotter, of course. I ran a 131.1 or two, whatever it was. And I just got the word that for the podium shootout is gonna be a two lap shootout. If you go four off, you're done, disqualified. But it's a complete time swipe. So all the shit that we've done before, reset. And so, yeah, full send, baby. One more session, that's it for the NOS Energy Track Battle Championship. And now we're about to get into the really fast, really, like really intensely fast cars. Yeah. Uh, the, you know, the...
Good shit, my boy. That's third place overall, second in class. There we go, my boy. Good shit, dude. Good shit. Audi R8, then Gabe Zamora in the Porsche 911, Robert Robles in the Toyota Supra, then William Kwok in the Corvette. So that is five different manufacturers, is that right? Uh, Tesla, Audi, Porsche, Toyota, and Chevrolet. All five different manufacturers in the top. in track mod. We'll see, uh, he's about three seconds off of De Koenig, so I'm not yeah. sure that, the, oh, Zamora, wow, that's tight in the 274. Whoa. That is the Porsche 911, only a tenth back behind Andrew De Koenig. Yeah, that was a lap. And uh, Zamora came in, uh, he had the third quickest uh, combined times here. Absolutely beautiful car. And uh, he had the third quickest combined time, but man, did he just uncork one here. And Quack. Uh, William Kwok, who, uh, if you remember, Kwok got into this uh, with a lap at the flag of that last, uh, the absolute last session is how he managed to get up there. And he's right with Zao at this point, but Zamora, man, is he pedaling up the hill here. <laughs> he is trying. All he needs is a tenth. And again, if you've got a crew, they can be watching the times and know what you need to be doing. But as a, if a driver is here all on their own, they have no clue yeah. where they're going to stand after lap one or lap, lap two. Here it comes, hard on the brakes. Turn it in and just that core. I mean, Porsche at Laguna Seca, can you get a more quintessential combination than that? I mean, yeah. just flowing so nicely. It's it's pretty definitive, isn't it? That's a great looking car, too. It sounds the part as yep. well. Checkered flag, De Koenig needs to improve. If Zamora's gonna go quicker, De Koenig at a 130.818. Didn't see the time go quick. Oh, Zhao to the top of the board in the Audi. Wow. 136.93. De Koenig did not improve. What does Zamora do in the last moment of asking? Gosh! Top of the board, Greg. 134.71. <laughs> Zamora in the Porsche. Quickest in track mod. And Zhao found three seconds on his second lap. Holy cow. That was just stunning. Uh, you know, Zamora uh, was able to, you know, he just added another second to it, but that lap by Zhao, because uh, he was in the same, that 133 range with Quack at the end of the first lap, and uh, boy, did he put up a time. That was an exceptional lap time, and just by two tenths of a second, four tenths covering the top three, that is unbelievable. Super cool to watch that happen, and Zamora looked so, uh, just so uh, delicate on the steering, and wasn't wrestling the car around, wasn't no. fighting it, it just drove its way to the top there. It was very Prostian. Yes. As in Alain Prost. Yes. Smooth. And, uh, you know, once you, uh, you understand that, you know, you can over hustle a car and you think, all right, I'm really getting after it here. Uh, you know, but if you're, if every input is really smooth and you can still feel that edge, so you get to that edge without it, you know, you know, approaching and getting ragged, that's where you find it. Quack, quack.
Literally right at the fucking edge. You're like, oh, I'll fucking roll through that, dude. Well, we fucking made it happen. Blown strut. <laughs> Used tires. Everyone was running stickers on the grid. You saw all the stickers. Augie's calling. What's up? Get your ass over here, baby. Get your ass over here. We gotta celebrate. Let's go. Let's go. All right. All right. Sounds good. Let's go. Oh shit! I can't believe I just did that. Thanks, bro. I'll see you. What an adrenaline dump, bro. Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, dude, I was hyping my shit up. I had Inner Sandman playing on. I was like, I got to come in and close this bitch out, man. Oh, my God. Uh, honestly, I don't even remember much of the laps, to be honest. Like, I was just so in the zone, so I can't even comment on that. Yeah, I just had no doubt the entire weekend, honestly. I had no doubt the entire weekend, if, if the showdown was like this, we'd get an opportunity to win. And sure enough, two laps shootout, got it done. What a fucking car, man. Blown strut, blown fucking strut. It's incredible, dude. You did an amazing job on everything on this weekend. You kept me in it, bro. <laughs> Man, save the fucking damper line. We lost fluid, we blew the shock. But if we lost all of it, it would be absolutely toast. Bro, unbelievable.